Jim Dermott is the father of defenseman Travis Dermott. He joins us now from Helsinki. Hello, we're just a few hours away from Canada's first game of the tournament against arch rival uh, USA. How are you preparing for this game? Well, it is a big game, that's for sure. And um, I guess the good thing about uh, hitting the USA early on in the in the tournament, that if things don't go exactly according to Hoyle, then there's time to, to fix things. But I've seen Canada play a few times um, prior to the tournament starting, and I'm pretty sure that we're going to have a very good chance of beating the USA. Yeah, well, you've traveled to Finland with quite a few family members. It is the holiday time, especially. So who's there with you to watch Travis play today? Right, so uh, my daughter Calandra is here, as well as my mom and her partner Bill, and uh, uh, my in-law as well, my mother-in-law is here. So uh, we have six in total in our group, and we're, uh, we're sure excited to be here. And what was Christmas like for you and your family? It was very different this year. Um, we, without having Travis with us, uh, we did get into Helsinki yesterday morning. Uh, we, were, uh, we were able to see him for two hours last night. So we had a quick, quick meal with him. It wasn't the traditional meal we would have had at home. Uh, I guess in Finland here, they celebrate their Christmas uh, mainly on Christmas Eve. So the restaurant in the hotel here, uh, I think we ended up having pizza and chicken wings. So uh, that's kind of how our, our meal went. But it was nonetheless uh, fun to see Travis again, for sure. Yeah, that's not too bad of a meal when you're traveling, especially. So what would you say it took for, uh, for your family and especially Travis to get to where he is today? So, you know, you reflect back to when his hockey started, and uh, it was a long road, and a lot, a lot of fun along the way, that's for sure. And for, his, uh, for him, it was a lot of perseverance. He had some injury challenges in, uh, later on in his minor hockey career. Um, but uh, he spent a lot of time on the ice, a lot of time off the ice as well, training. And being a professional hockey player was really front and center for him for his entire life. And I think you could say he had a family that truly supported his endeavor. And um, we, uh, uh, we really enjoyed the, the ride with him. Yeah, so how does it feel to, to have him representing Canada on the world stage now? It's a pretty cool feeling. Um, I can only, uh, I guess, when I reflect to how the feeling was after he got drafted by the Toronto Maple Leafs, for days after that, it was really hard to, to come to some belief that, in fact, that happened. And the same has happened here because we only found out a few days ago that he was actually on the team. And I, I find myself uh, pondering and asking myself as the days go on, is he officially on this team? So I'm truly waiting to see him with that leaf flag on his sweater, uh, the Canadian Maple Leaf, not the Toronto Maple Leaf, but watching him on the ice uh, in a few hours is going to be a pretty, uh, pretty important time and an emotional time for me too. And do you know how Travis is feeling going into today's game? Yeah, we, we saw him last night for a bit, and he seems he seems calm. He seems he says the team is ready uh, mentally, physically. Uh, he's he's feeling strong, um, and he says the team is uh, mentally prepared for this hockey match. What was the last thing you said to him? I told him I love him, that I'm proud of him, and uh, you know I, I think he's going to have a great tournament. So play with confidence, and I think that's. That's a pretty important part when you're on a, on a stage that this, that's this big. Yes. Well, the rest of Canada is cheering Travis, cheering Travis and the rest of the team on, Jim. All the best to you and your family there in Helsinki. Thanks for joining us. Merry Christmas to all Canadians, and go Canada, go. <laughs> Jim Dermott, uh, Travis Dermott's father, joining us in Helsinki. Ahead of today's game between Canada and the USA.